Welcome to 5-Minute Bedtime Stories, brought to you by Tailbot, your child's AI storyteller. Want to create a bedtime story for your child? Visit tailbotaicom create. Now, let's sit back and enjoy the story. Lisa and the Enchanted Forest of Dreams A special bedtime story for Lisa Once upon a time, in a cozy little house nestled near a sparkling river, lived a sweet little girl named Lisa. Every night, Lisa's mom would tuck her into bed and tell her the most magical stories that would whisk her off to dreamland. But one night, something special happened. Lisa's mom handed her a brand new book called My Very Favorite Book in the Whole Wide World by Malcolm Mitchell. Lisa's eyes sparkled with excitement as she held the book close to her heart. Mommy, will you read this new book to me? Lisa asked with a twinkle in her eyes. Of course, my darling, her mom replied. But before we begin, let's enter the land of dreams together. Lisa snuggled deeper into her soft bed as her mom started reading. As the story unfolded, Lisa's imagination took flight, and she found herself in a magical forest filled with towering trees and shimmering flowers. The air smelled sweet, and tiny fireflies danced around like living stars. In this enchanted forest, Lisa discovered that each tree held a unique story inside its bark. The wise old oak tree shared stories of bravery and adventure, while the graceful willow tree whispered tales of friendship and love. Lisa couldn't believe her eyes and ears, she was surrounded by stories, just like in her very own book. Curiosity tugged at Lisa's heart, and she decided to explore further. With each step, she discovered more amazing things. Birds with rainbow-colored feathers sang melodious songs, and mischievous squirrels scampered playfully through the branches. Lisa giggled as she watched a family of rabbits hop over moss-covered rocks, and she smiled at the wise owl who perched on a branch, his eyes twinkling with knowledge. As Lisa walked deeper into the forest, she stumbled upon a sparkling pond. The water was so clear that she could see her reflection, and suddenly, something extraordinary happened. The pond shimmered and swirled, creating a magical portal. Lisa's heart raced with excitement, and without hesitation, she leaped into the portal. When Lisa opened her eyes, she found herself in a magnificent library. Books of all shapes and sizes lined the shelves, reaching up to the sky. The library was filled with laughter, whispers, and the rustling of turning pages. Lisa gasped in wonder. She had entered the world of books. In this magical library, Lisa met new friends who were just as enthusiastic about reading as she was. Together, they embarked on thrilling adventures through the pages of their favorite stories. They sailed the seven seas with pirates, traveled to distant lands with brave explorers, and even flew on the backs of dragons through the clouds. But as much as Lisa loved every story she encountered, she couldn't find the one that spoke to her heart. She searched high and low, but each book left her feeling unfulfilled. It seemed like her favorite story was still waiting to be discovered. Determined to find her special book, Lisa ventured to the tallest bookshelf in the library. As she reached out for a book, a tiny, shimmering fairy appeared before her. Hello, dear child, the fairy said with a soft voice. I am the storyteller fairy. I have been watching you explore the enchanting forest and this marvelous library. Lisa's eyes widened with excitement. Do you know where I can find my favorite story? The storyteller fairy smiled warmly. Your favorite story is not in a book, my dear. It lies within your heart. Your imagination and dreams hold the key to the most magical stories of all. Lisa's heart swelled with understanding. She realized that she didn't need a book to find her favorite story. The stories she could imagine in her mind were as real and enchanting as any book she had ever read. As Lisa bid farewell to the storyteller fairy, she closed her eyes and imagined the most extraordinary story she had ever dreamed of, a tale filled with kindness, bravery, and a dash of magic. And in that moment, Lisa's favorite story came to life, painting vivid pictures in her mind. With a contented smile on her face, Lisa returned home, knowing that the stories she cherished resided not only in the pages of books, but also in her own imagination. Every night, as Lisa's mom tucked her into bed, she would ask, Tell me your favorite story, Lisa. And Lisa would close her eyes, her imagination soaring high, as she shared her own magical tales of adventure, friendship, and love. 
From that day forward, Lisa embraced the power of her imagination and discovered that her favorite story in the whole wide world was the one she could create herself. As she drifted off to sleep, dreaming of new stories and exciting adventures, Lisa knew that her imagination held endless possibilities, just like the enchanted forest and the library of dreams. And so, with each passing night, Lisa's imagination continued to grow, fueling her dreams and filling her heart with joy. From that day on, Lisa became the storyteller of her own magical tales, forever exploring the vast expanse of her imagination. The End Thank you for joining us on this enchanting journey. If you enjoyed tonight's story, remember, the magic doesn't have to end here. Craft your own adventure with Tailbot by visiting tailbotaicom create. And as a special treat, use the coupon code TAIL99 at checkout to get your bedtime story for just 99 cents, instead of the usual $2.99. Sweet dreams and until our next tale.